hello everyone welcome back to my channel i'm here with the new question that is on multi level paging and it has been asked in gate 2008 and it has been suggested by one of my subscriber so let's discuss it so a processor uses 36 bit physical addresses and 32 bit virtual addresses so 36 bit physical address is the address of the main memory and 32 bit virtual address is the address of secondary memory with a page frame size of 4 kilobytes so as we know page size is equal to frame size so it is of 4 kilobytes each page table entry size is of 4 bytes as you know we need we what we store in page table the frame number right so the address of the frame we store there and it is of 4 bytes here we are using a three level page table to convert the virtual to physical address translation first two bits are used to index into the first level page table next Nine bits are used to index into the second level page table, and next nine bits are used to index into the third level page table, and the last twelve bits are used as offset within the page. So these has been given for thirty-two bit virtual addresses, and what we want to know the number of bits required for addressing the next level page table in the page table entry of the first, second, and third level page table. Let's see it. let's see to it how to solve this okay so so this is all that has been given in the question virtual address is of 32 bits and physical address is of 36 bits so let's see how to solve it if i draw addressing a scheme so the first index 1 is of 2 bits as it has been given and the next index that is index 2 it is of 9 bits then the next index it is of index 3 it which is of 9 bits again and the last is offset it is of 12 bits it it has already been given in the question so first index 1 is actually actually pointing to the level 1 page table okay and the next level like this and the next level page next level index point to the next level page table that is level 2 page table and index 3 pointing to the third level page table that is level 3 page table and the last that is offset it is the actual address of the page where the actual data or instruction is stored right so it is pointing to the main memory the frame of the main memory okay so if i draw the address generated by the cpu which is also known as logical address and virtual address it is of 32 bits as given in the question cpu generated address contains the frame and the offset and the physical address which is actually pointing to the main memory it also contains two things and which is of 36 bits it is of frame number and offset and d so these two offsets that is of logical address and physical address these two offsets are same that is of 12 bits 12 bits offset is there in the virtual address also 12 bits offset is there in the physical address also okay the logical address pointing to the page number and the offset and physical address pointing to the frame number and offset so as we all know the formula of calculating the memory size which is equal to memory size equal to number of entries in that memory and the size of each location and the size of each location okay so if i want to calculate the memory size of uh, main memory it will contain as we know the main memory is divided into equal size of page uh, equal size of frame and the secondary memory is divided into equal size of pages 
so each page size or each frame size is given as 4 kilobytes but in each page we store multiple addresses and the size of each address is of 1 byte okay so let, let's put it into the formula so memory size is of 4 kilobyte the page size if i'm saying it is a page size 4 kilobyte we don't know the number of entries and the size of each location is 1 byte so after calculating the number of entries it is of 4 kilobyte divided by 1 byte 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 will be cancelled and we are getting 4k entries within the page we are calculating the number of entries within the page so if i buy, if i write it into power it is to the power 12 entries within the page so offset is to the power 12 that's why offset is given as 12 bits so total to power 12 entries can be there in the each page and as well as in the frame so as we know the offset is same for both logical address and physical address this d are same it has been calculated it is of 12 bits okay so 12 bits is derived now if I want to calculate the number of pages as we don't know the number of pages but we know the page frame size so we can calculate that using this formula okay so the physical address number of bits is given as 36 bit we can put it that into the formula so we can calculate the memory size of the physical address or main memory if it is a 36 bit so the total number of entries in a main memory it is of 2 to the power 36 bits and the size of each location is multiplied uh, size of each location is 1 byte we can multiply that into with we can multiply that with 2 power 36 and we are getting 2 power 36 byte is the size of main memory so if I again put the formula the same uh, if I again put the same thing into the formula the memory size is 2 power 36 byte we can get the number of entries as the number of pages here the size of each location is given as 4 KB because we are calculating the number of pages and size of each page is given as 4 KB okay so we are writing 4 KB here main memory secondary memory the page size and the frame size is same in main memory we call it as a frame right so it is same as space size or frame size so we multiply here with 4 kb and what we get after calculating number of entries will be 2 power 36 byte divided by 2 power 12 bytes so byte byte will be cancelled and we are getting 2 power 24 right so what does it mean 2 power 24 entries are there 2 power 24 pages are there right 2 power 24 frames are there because it is 36 bit bits addresses of physical address so what we calculated it is of level 3 so level 3 is pointing to the main memory frame so the address of the frame it is of 24 bits so the number of bits which is there in the level 3 page table it is of 24 bits so the b and d option is b and d option is looking same right so b uh, main memory the frame address is of 24 bits so level 3 is also having the 24 bits okay 24 has been calculated as level 3 now level 2 and level 1 have been left so we can calculate it in the same manner first we have to calculate the size of the level 3 page table because if we calculate the size of the level 3 page table we can find out the number of bits required to store it the possible number or worst case bit bits that which is required to store it okay so level 3 page table size can be calculated so same formula memory size equal to number of entries here number of entries is 2 power 9 as you can see there index 3 is pointing to the 
pointing with 9 bits to power 9 and the size of each location is given as 4 bytes page table entry size we are calculating the size of the page table that's why we are taking the size of each location as 4 bytes and 4, four bytes can be written as 2 power 2 bytes so total 2 power 11 bytes it is the size of level 3 page table and if it is so the size of level 3 page table is 2 power 11 bytes as we have calculated it as 2 power 11 bytes now we can find out the total number of bits required to store the level 3 page table into main memory right so our main memory it is of 36 bits so the same formula we can put 2 power 36 byte is the size of the main memory will be equal to the number of entries that we want to calculate and the size of each location is 2 power 11 byte because the page table size is given as 2 power 11 byte so we are taking it as 2 power 11 byte that is the size of so now we are trying to find out the number of pages required to store the level 3 page table so what it is number of entries the number of bits required for addressing the next level page table so whatever will be the number of bits number of entries that we are calculating here or the number of bits required to store these number of pages will be the number of bits for level 2 because level 2 is pointing to the next level page table right so 2 power 36 byte divided by 2 power 11 byte 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 cancel and we are getting 2 power 25 number of entries so to address the 2 power 25 entries we need 25 bits and it is the address of the level the number of bits required to address the level 3 page table so 25 bit is there inside the level 2 to level 2 page table contains the 25 bit address to address the next level page table that is level 3 okay so in the same way we can calculate the level 1 also so level 1 will be pointing to the next level page table that is level 2 page table so how we can calculate it by calculating the level 2 page table size so level 2 page table size can be calculated as level 3 here we have calculated it is also having the 2 power 9 entries and 2 power 2 byte as the page page table entry size is given as 4 byte we will be getting 2 power 11 byte only the same thing the same formula we will put and we will get the second level page table number of entries that we require to store the second level page table is 2 power 25 that means level 1 also will contain the 25 bits to access the level 2 page tables because the possible number of bits that is required to address the next level page table is 25 so if I <clears throat> put it into the answer the way if I answer it the way it wants the number of bits required in level 1 to address the next level page table that is level 2 is 25 bits and the level number of bits required in level 2 is 25 bits to address the next level page table that is level 3 and and level 3 contains 24 bits that is the actual address of the frame of the main memory so option d is the correct that is 25 25 and 24 that we are getting here so I, that's all for this question i hope this will help you to solve the same type of question thanks for watching